Hey guys, welcome back to Fit Life Champions. I'm Dave Glazer. We have a Tabata workout today. I have just completed my foam rolling to prepare. I'm a little sore from yesterday's workout. If you haven't gotten it yet, just click back to the last lesson in your program and you're gonna love it. Um, Tabata, so six exercises, six rounds of each, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds rest, and a little bit of a break in between. But first, we've got a warm up. So 20 jumping jacks. skaters so to the side to the side good a lot of lateral movement it's ten each side there's four five five six six nine nine ten and ten all right as we warm up the cardiovascular system, get the blood flowing. 20 jumping jacks. You got it, you got it. 10 and 10. One more round of our warm up. Here we go. 20 jumping jacks. Nine, ten, ten, good. We got to go through our dynamic warm up to prevent injury. Draw up on each knee. Feel that hamstring in the glute. Good. Grab your quad. Reach up and out. Whew. Baby dinos, drive the heel into the ground. Reach for the toe. Stand all the way up in between each rep. Good. Rock from heel to toe. Two, three, four, five, six. Point the toe. Spin for controlled articular rotations of the ankle joint. Switch. Good. Step up and over that hurdle, front to back. Good. Back to front. Good. Small circles forward. Not a lot of upper body, at least as far as pressing exercises go today, but we've got four lower body exercises and two core specific. Reverse, go backwards. Two core specific exercises. Again, six rounds of each exercise that lasts for 20 seconds each with 10 seconds of rest in between. 15 seconds between each exercise. And we're gonna start with some side lunges. So let me start your timer and hit those side lunges. Ready, set, go. So side lunge to the center. There you go. 20 seconds, six rounds total. 
Okay. Make sure that trailing leg stays straight. Good, short rest, 10 seconds. We're gonna be sweating and huffing and puffing by the end of this 18 minute workout program. Three, two, one. Good, halfway through this second round. We start with side lunges because it's an extension of our dynamic warm up. And it also stabilizes the outside knee, ankle, and hip. Second resting period here. Ready? Side lunges. I love these workouts because they can go anywhere. You can do them anytime, travel, or right in your home. Good, short rest. Feel that heart rate, here we go. Keep that chest up. We got one more. Last one. Keep it up, keep it up. Finish strong. Finish strong. Good. Here's our 15 second rest period. And coming up, we've got a lateral squat jump. Okay? Six rounds of those. In three, two, one. Visualize there's a line on the floor that you've got to get up and over. You can turn it into a little step if you want. From here to here and back and forth. extra challenging less like a dynamic warm-up and more of like we're getting into it now Job, keep it up, finish strong. I should feel that by now. Three, two, one. Go. 
One more round of those coming up. Those are brutal. Three, two, one. We've got half burpees or a high plank hop. So we're gonna start down in a high plank position. And hop forward, hop back, forward, back, forward, back. Here's your alternate half burpee. Hip width apart on your hop forward. Those should be challenging. Three, two, one. one of those is harder. Keep it up, keep it up, you got it. Let's see how sweaty we can get. Get it, get it, get it. Here's our 15 second rest period. We're gonna go to a half V up next. So we'll start on the back. Palms flat, legs flat, up into the V up position here. Big breath out as you go up. period should be needing it by now more than halfway through our workout on the glutes.
You might be feeling the hip flexors there. We're also in the low core. Ready? Finish strong. Finish strong. Should be feeling it by now. Three, two, one. All the way, all the way. Here's our 15 second rest period. Can't imagine how hard that was for you guys. It was pretty brutal for me. So we've got Russian twist coming up next. So balance on your glutes and twist, 20 seconds. Little tiny twists, side to side. Hopefully I get six rounds of those. Stay with me here. That is no joke. Finish strong, guys, finish strong. Four more rounds of Russian twist. Keep breathing. Stay there, keep it up. Three, two, one. Three more rounds of Russian twist. Should be getting our sweat on by now. those guys in three two one twist Bit of that low back challenge there. Stay strong. Last one. You got it. You got it. You got it. Stay with me now. Uh, three, two, one. Here's our 15 second rest period before we get into our final exercise, which is high knees. So stay with me here, guys. This is like sprinting to the finish. Get them up, get them up, get them up. up there get that calorie burn it's only about a 18 minute workout here today guys we're just about two minutes away from finishing it up high knees let's go
Here it is. up here guys all the way finish strong ready get them up high knees high knees There, guys, finish strong. Here we go. <sighs> One more round. Not too bad here today, guys. Just a whole lot of sweat, not so many tears. Congratulations, guys. That was a hell of a workout today. Proud of you. Well, we let our heart rate and our cardiovascular kind of calm down here a little bit. We're gonna go into a little bit of static stretching, especially for the groin and the hamstring. So find a seat and we got a butterfly stretch. As always, Tabata really does get a lot accomplished in such a short period of time. Hamstring stretch, reach for the toe. Hold these stretches for as long as you like. Some body parts are tighter than the others. Like my groin is pretty tight from the last workout that we did as a group. And these hamstrings are pretty tight as well from the running and the half burpees. So fold that ankle across the opposite knee and twist towards that front knee. And you'll feel a piriformis stretch down here. stand up. We're going to do a long stride. This is like warrior stretch in yoga. Make sure the hips are square, shoulders are square towards that front wall, and you'll feel this rear hip flexor here. Reach up towards the ceiling for warrior, and you'll feel an even deeper stretch in the front side of the hip. Some balance there as well. Switch to the other side. Square hips, square shoulders. Reach for the ceiling. Oh yeah, good stretch down there through the right hip flexor for me. Not to mention that challenge to the balance. So, way to go guys. That was our fifth or sixth Tabata workout in the last few months. I wanna say I'm really proud of you for finishing that one strong. Stay tuned for the next workout. Go ahead, feel free to post in the Facebook group or email me uh, questions. We have our weekly calls on Tuesdays at noon, Mountain Standard Time. Just check your email and the Facebook group for the details on that weekly call. That's your hint. That's your opportunity to ask me any question that pertains to fitness, health and wellness, and nutrition so that you can get to your goals quickly and safely. Again, thanks for tuning in. Dave Glazer at Fit Life Champions.